Once upon a time, there was a village called Kuntala in Africa. This village was blessed with abundant resources, and its land was exceptionally fertile. Food was never a concern in this village. The primary occupation in the village was farming, which included both crop cultivation and animal husbandry. The people of Kuntala were always joyful, and on weekend nights they would gather at the village square, including their king and all the village elders, to play drums and dance. During these gatherings, food and local drinks were freely distributed. It was also a time for young men to court young ladies, as it was a period of socializing. Among the young women was a particularly beautiful lady named Adada, who never accepted any proposals from the young men. Her reason was that she wanted to marry a wealthy man. Being aware of her beauty, she knew men would go to great lengths to win her over. Many men proposed, yet she consistently rejected their offers. Kuntala village had neighboring villages, and young men from these areas who were well off also came to try their luck. But Adada still refused them. This news spread far and wide, attracting young men from afar, who came to Kuntala to see Adada. Upon witnessing her beauty, they confirmed what they had heard and proposed. But after Adada's evaluation, she turned them down as well. Years passed, and Adada grew even more beautiful. The elders of Kuntala village, along with her parents, took it upon themselves to advise her, reminding her that not all that glitters is gold, but she ignored their counsel. One afternoon while she was sleeping, Adaada had a dream. In this dream, she was walking with a young man who was very wealthy. Upon waking, she wished that the young man from her dream would come and propose to her. Three days later, she heard a knock on her door. She to open it, and to her surprise, it was the same man from her dream accompanied by his parents seeking her hand in marriage. She did not hesitate as she had already seen this young man in her dream. She was thrilled to be marrying the man of her dreams. A date was set for the traditional marriage. Everyone who heard that Adada was finally getting married could hardly believe it. So they all came to witness the ceremony. It was one of the most splendid marriage ceremonies ever held. After the ceremony, the man took Adada away. They walked for three days, yet they remained in the forest. Adada became frightened and sought answers. But before she could speak, her husband transformed into a giant snake. Little did Adada know that the man was not human, but a spirit from the forest. Please kindly subscribe, like, comment, and share. Moral lesson. We are not to feel proud because of what we possess, for all that we possess are temporary. We should rather trust in God for his blessings.